So here's some weird stuff about Russia. This is the metro. You do not talk on the metro. You watch the TV and the cat cartoons, or you play on your phone, and that is it. That's all. When you get off the metro, there are these really beautiful platforms. This is the Kremlovskaya stop. When you get home, you put a key fob up to a magnet. It beeps. You go in. You walk up a set of stairs. And then there's an elevator. Why is the elevator not before the stairs? I don't know, but this is Russia. So normally, there's at least one more door. One that separates two or three apartments from the hallway that gets its own key, and then you have our individual apartment door. Our apartment doesn't have one of these, quite sadly. So, you get to your door, and you put the key in, and you turn twice. Our keys are really weirdly shaped here. And then you go into your living room bedroom combo, where your roommate is watching YouTube. To be fair, the living room bedroom combo is not that common, but still, that's what we got. If you want to go to the bathroom, make sure you turn the light on before you go inside. How many Americans does it take to change a light bulb in Russia? Apparently two, although in this video you can only see one doing all the work. Although a lot of the work was just going to the store and asking questions in a language that you don't speak, so that was fun. To wash your hands in the bathroom, you turn the right knob for hot water and the left knob for cold water. Maybe a little backwards from home, but easy enough to figure out. To take a shower, you turn the red knob for hot and the blue knob for cold, so it's the same as being at home. But inexplicably, in the kitchen, if you want to wash dishes or your hands, you turn the blue knob for hot and the red knob for cold. And apparently, this is normal for Russia. In fact, it's weird that our shower blue knob is cold and our red one is hot. What the heck is going on with you, Russia? Now for some weird kitchen things. Pepper comes in this weird package and does not go next to the salt. Milk comes in a box, and you don't have to refrigerate it until you open it. Bread is never sliced, ever. And even though the sun rises at 3 in the morning, this is what curtains look like. So living in Russia makes you a little quirky. But I was a little quirky anyway, so I guess it's fine. 